Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and fold this properly and get it to go into there.
So you can see the glue here, this is to actually make it less contact so you don't have so much traction. I might do that. This is the first guy I actually saw to just look at his car and see him do that. Which is, I've seen it done, of course. Let's go check out another car. He's got the, uh, oh wait, where'd it go? Where did it go? He's got the monster right here. Little 50 push out the Mamba right there, set up some carbon fiber, soft springs, nice aluminum upgrades here and there. Everything any boy would like. I like what he did here too, that's good. See the way he set it up? It's giving you guys another way out there because you're limited on space. So here's another setup. It's also good for weight balance, I believe. Here's another one. This guy's got a lot of room. I mean, that's what happens when you use that dynamite, dynamite setup. You get a 70 push out on that battery on the 70 C rating. Might want to try that out, you guys. Look him up. Cool little charger there. Oh wow! I went actually paid attention to the stop. Cool. All right, Ted, you're going on the phone.
Got some races happening here soon, so let's talk about the car real quick. I've already went through my spectrum, so here's my second one right now. It's gonna happen. Got my 25 ESC Gold Star combo setup with their little 
72k, 72,000k, I can't talk, you know what it is, 72,000kV motor. Now, I didn't get the motor plate, and I only got one screw in here, so it tend to slipping a little bit, and let's just hope it doesn't slip all the way. So let's land those jumps smooth, so that doesn't loosen up on me. Got my nice little under plastic deal condom. It really does help. Uh, she even said they got a new carpet, so they don't want the screws coming out. They don't want tire goop on it, and they really do want you to check to make sure you got your screws because they don't want anything on there. And I can see it could hurt somebody. I mean, it getting underneath the tire and it just aiming somewhere at the right angle and just get your eye. That's lethal. So that's good. No safety first. Got my lap counter. Got my Turnigy 3240C push on the battery. Now, I don't know what that means, 30 to 40. Let's just hope it's 40. But other than that, it's not bad. Um, I do have the little bit harder spring up front, but uh, I loosened it up a little bit. Hopefully it works out. So, wish me luck.